Hello there, my friends. I just wanted to show you something. Somebody asked me, what, what does it mean when you have a stripped screw? And, uh, you know, that might be something that's obvious to people that do a lot of handiwork, but for somebody that doesn't, they may not know what that means. Here's a good example. This screw on the left has been stripped. And what that means is these two screws were identical until somebody, uh, <clears throat> me, um, stripped the screw. And what I, what I mean is I had the screwdriver in the screw tip like this, but as I was turning it, it kept slipping out, slipping, slipping, slipping. And then eventually what happened was it wore out the threads until I got to the point where it pretty much slipped on every turn. And now it kind of like spins in the hole, so you can't get a good grip on it and uh, it won't go out. Now there's ways to get around that. Uh, they're called easy outs and you usually use a drill to, to get a, a screw that's been stripped badly out. But the point is you don't want to get to this point. So if you're tightening a screw and you find that the, uh, the uh, screwdriver is slipping, you want to make sure you're not going to strip that screw. So what you may want to do is pull it out. If you're drilling, if you're screwing into wood, you may want to drill a uh, pilot hole, um, a larger pilot hole, so that it'll uh, it won't have to, you won't have to use much force. Or usually, uh, most things come with several uh, backup screws, and so you want to get one that's going to be tight because you you might want to get that out someday, and you're going to want to have threads. You know, you're going to want to have the head of the screw. Um, the screwdriver sit in the head of the screw pretty well. So anyway, that's the difference between, uh, that's what it means when somebody says a strip screw. So now you know. So have a great day. Smash like, take care.